pound sterling to US dollar catches a much needed break, grasping at 1.22. The pound sterling to US dollar caught some lift on Thursday, rising back to the 1.2200 handle. Friday sees UK GDP figures amidst a slew of low tier data. The pound sterling is broadly expected to continue weakening looking out long term. The pound sterling to US dollar managed to eke out a minor recovery on Friday, owing more to a step back in the broad market US dollar index, DXY, than any intrinsic strength to be found in the pound sterling, GBP. Read more. Pound sterling to US dollar remains vulnerable to the 1.201.21 area, ing the pound and euro should weaken substantially through early 2024, Wells Fargo. Pound sterling to US dollar needs to surpass 1.2350 to show more meaningful technical strength, Scotiabank. Emerging markets Latam FX and stocks fall as dollar, US yields weigh on risk assets. SEP 26, Reuters, Latin American currencies fell against a stronger dollar and MSCI's index of stocks in the region dropped to a near four-month low on Tuesday, as investors soured on risk assets amid worries about the impact of higher for longer interest rates. Prosecutors in Spain accuse Shakira of more tax fraud. The criminal complaint filed by prosecutors in Barcelona says Shakira didn't report all of her income in 2018, when she lived in Barcelona with former soccer star Gerard Piquet and their two children, El País reported. The couple ended their 11-year relationship last year. Redux of 1998 sell-off hits Japan bonds as boss support wanes. Japan's government bonds are set for the worst quarterly sell-off in more than two decades as the central bank loosens its grip on the market. That's a reminder for investors that the nation's debt market relies in part on support from public sector institutions like the Bank of Japan to outperform global peers. The securities have lost 3% in the third quarter, the biggest drop since 1998, according to Bloomberg compiled data as of Thursday. Government bonds globally outside Japan have slumped 4.6% during the same period, the most in a year, as lingering inflationary pressure fuels expectations that interest rates will stay high for longer. Fed holding steady at September FOMC meeting was appropriate. Fed has time to see data before deciding what's next for rates path forward depends on what happens with inflation will be watching job market closely for clues. Thank you. 